I've been studying kanji, which is the uh, one of the writing systems in Japan that you just have to keep going at. You have to learn thousands of kanji. So I've been working really hard every day, trying to get like 10 new kanji a day, so I can see my 2,000 kanji I need to learn away in a, in a few months. Um, this is the book I've been using as a, a part of my study. It's actually um, uh, a book of first year kanjis. So it's... Uh, uh, I think that's Shogaku Ichinensei. Shogaku Ichinensei. Shogaku means elementary school, primary school. Ichinensei means first grade. So this is like a book for uh, first years in primary school. Um, it's got some like really simple basic kanji to start with, like one, two, uh, things like mountain, tree, really simple stuff. Um, it gets a little bit more complicated as you go along. Up, down, river, one, two, three. Um, this is sun or day, this is moon or month, uh, this is hand, this is ear. Uh, but at the same time as doing these simple kanjis, I've been uh, studying some more complicated ones uh, using an app on my phone, if I can find some of those. Here we are, look. So, as well as the simple ones, I've been studying some more complicated ones, all sorts of different kanji. Uh, and today, Today I learnt a new kanji, I'm just really excited, I learnt a new kanji which uh, is going to enable me to spell out using kanji a word you might recognise. So here we go, look, I already knew this one, I learnt this one a while ago. Uh, this is the kanji for like hide or creep and it's pronounced nin, nin, and this is the kanji for a person or professional. It's like someone who's professional at something. And that's pronounced normally sha, but in a compound word like this it's ja. Uh, 